take this opportunity to read it publicly. It goes something like this. An open letter to Miller Coors Brewing CEO, Leo Keeley. <laughs> Dear Mr. Leo Keeley, I would like to take this opportunity to, on behalf of a grateful nation, thank you for your wonderful new beer packaging concepts. <laughs> I know that myself, like many of my fellow patriotic Americans, Look to your television commercials to help me decide what beer I should be drinking. <laughs> and your most recent spots, as they say in the industry, have made me a fan for life. Or until the next really cool beer bottle or can is released by one of your competitors. Whichever comes first. Wow. I don't know where to begin. Your innovative staff and super intelligent scientists have come up with so much to praise. I guess I will start with a new Miller Lite Vortex bottle. Unbelievable! I can't believe it took this long for our great country to place the man on the moon to produce such a long needed beer drinking innovation. A Vortex neck at the top of a Miller Lite bottle. <laughs> when I saw your commercial telling this new bottle, the first thing I thought was, what does a Vortex bottle actually mean when I'm drinking your fabulous products? <laughs> then I realized, why should I mess things up by thinking such silly thoughts? I should just shut up and drink my beer. If you say I need a Vortex bottle, Mr. Keeley, why should I question it? <laughs> I should remember what I read on the internet, that the marketing magazine Brand Week quoted the Miller Coors representative as telling your beer distributors that the specially designed grooves, quote, create a vortex when pouring the beer, unquote. And that your company's goal was to, quote, quote, create buzz and excitement and give consumers another reason to choose Miller. As George Bush said, mission accomplished. <laughs> the second thing I thought of Mr. Keeley was leadership, yours. I have some knowledge of how these things work. I know that the day after whatever mega genius in one of your labs had that aha moment and created the Vortex bottle, it didn't magically appear on shelves so millions of appreciative beer drinkers could buy Vortex bottles for themselves. No way. This wonderful invention had to endure marketing planning sessions, focus groups, and a slow climb up the ladder of corporate bureaucracy. Each step on the way, someone had to give it the go-ahead until the decision to launch the multi-million dollar campaign heralding the arrival of the Miller Lite Vortex bottle landed in your capable lap. Did you listen to the naysayers who said spending untold amounts of money to introduce a Vortex bottle in our struggling economy was a mistake? <laughs> that it was a silly, meaningless product that did nothing to improve the taste of your beer? That America didn't need a Vortex bottle? <laughs> no. No, no. Leo Keeley did not listen to those Luddites. Leo Keeley has vision. He is a forward-thinking leader who realizes that in this global economy, we as a country cannot rest on our laurels. Today, the neck of Miller Lite bottles have specially designed grooves. When will we see an entirely grooved bottle? I know it won't be long. Miller Coors. That is why I won't think of drinking anything other than Miller Lights. I wouldn't, that is, until I saw a commercial for your other barrier-smashing beer, Coors Light. And that commercial, which I keep seeing, has delivered something magical, something I only previously dreamed of. A window in the packaging of your Coors Light 12 packs and cases that tells me if my beer is cold or not. <laughs> God bless you, Leo Keeley. One day I will look down the disbelieving eyes of my grandchildren and tell them when I was a child <laughs> that to make a phone call I had to use a device that was tethered to something. That to look at pornography I had to bribe an older person to buy me a magazine. <laughs> And to find out the beer I wanted to purchase was cold, I actually had to touch it. <laughs> we live in glorious times, do we not? Your Coors Light cold activation window will make shopping for beer a simpler task for generations to come. 
I never thought we would live to see the day. A cold activation window. Mr. Keeley, what will you and the other wizards at Miller Coors think of next? An eager nation longingly awaits. Well, Leo Keeley, you have done so much for me and the United States of America, I feel I should do something for you. So here's some advice. Don't make vacation plans for early December unless it is in Sweden, for that is when they give out the Nobel Prizes. <laughs> Yours thankfully, Paul Turner.